Mr. Speaker, I would like to this morning highlight and acknowledge the important work of the Ministry of National Security's Gang Violence. Excuse me, Mr. Speaker. Thank you. Okay, he took his glasses. Mr. Speaker, I would like to highlight and acknowledge the important work of the Ministries of National Security's Gang Violence Reduction Team, Primary Prevention Initiative called the Elliott Kings Group. Mr. Speaker, the Gang Violence Reduction Team has been working hard in our public schools since September 2018. The team has strategically partnered with the Ministry of Education, the Bermuda Police Service, the Bermuda Child and Family Services, court services and various school administrators, student services, and community organizations to provide various support services for at-risk students and deliver prevention programs targeted to specific year groups. Mr. Speaker, the Elliott Kings Group is a targeted primary prevention initiative delivered by the Gang Violence Reduction Team in conjunction with the Elliott Primary School Administration and the Living Legends Community Organization. The initiative's specialized curriculum includes 14 experimentally based sessions which are delivered and targeted to primary five and six students. Sessions focus on self-esteem, positive relationship building skills, teamwork, and building res resilience. The initiative was designed to reduce risk factors, enhance pr protective factors, increase academic motivation, and to increase developmental factors in the young people participating. Mr. Speaker, yesterday I had the opportunity to watch 14 young men at their completion ceremony. A young men gave testimonials on how the group impacted them and why it was important for them to participate. I learned that for the majority of the young people participating, this group has been a safe place where they can speak freely about their challenges, their fears, and their triumphs. It was also a, a space where they can be themselves, ask questions. They can be pushed to try new things and step outside of their comfort zones. Mr. Speaker, the LA primary principal, Kimberly Crichton, spoke yesterday about the changes the school had seen in the young men participating in the program. She reported that the young men were fully engaged and looked forward, and looked forward, looked forward to each session. Principal Crichton reflected positively on the changes in, that the classroom teachers have seen and the counselors that they have seen within the young man. The principal said she was proud to announce that there has been a major decrease in discipline referrals and an increase in participation for the young men who were involved in the program. Mr. Speaker, I would like to congratulate all 14 of these courageous young men for their hard work, dedication, and commitment to the program. Mr. Desai, Master Desai Harvey, Master Zion Smith Codrington, Master Kyron, Kyra Richardson, Master Josiah Smith, Master Denari York, Master Gregory Talbot, Master Mason Whitehead, Master Zaire Swan, Master Chris River Curtis, Master Zayden Smith Codrington, Master Kadaya Minus, Master Yako Simons, Master Kaish Lambert, M Master Zani Trim. I would also like to hi highlight the special award winners, Mr. Zaire Swan and Mr. River Curtis, the recipients of the most improved award, and Mr. Gregory Talbot, the, re the recipient of the Alchemy Fitness Comfort Zone Award, and Mr. Kaya Richardson, the recipient of the overall leadership award. Mr. Speaker, I would like to personally thank the Allen Primary School Principal Kimberly Crichton and the teaching staff for their support of the students throughout the initiative. I would like to thank Mr. Darren Woods, Youth Outreach and Prevention Manager of the Gang Violence Reduction Program. Mr. Ian Koch, founder of the Living, Living Legends Community Organization. Mr. Don Vickers, Behavioral Therapist at the Elliott Primary School for designing, coordinating, and delivering this amazing, amazing initiative. Their involvement and their leadership is inspiring, and the impact will be seen for years to come on the students as it is immeasurable. Mr. Speaker, the Primary School Prevention Initiative is one of the programs that the Ministry of National Security's Gang Violence Reduction Team has within its arsenal. This program will be delivered in two additional targeted primary schools next year. 
I am looking forward to seeing equally uplifting results in the young men selected for next year's initiative. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.